Oh, no. No, no. Bro, come on. Don't do this. Don't make me watch this. What's going on, you guys? The Demi Guy back on Demi Guy E and Teens. Now bringing you another reaction video. So, man, oh man, we are finally here and we are finally doing it. I see what all of you are saying in the comments. I see what the video is doing. I believe my Young Royals trailer reaction, which if you haven't watched it right now, you can go check out my reaction to the official Young Royals trailer right here. Go see what I had to say there. That video has become the third most popular video on my channel and is on route to being the second most popular video on my entire channel so i see the love and the support that you guys are bringing me on that video i see all the comments you guys are saying on there so with that being said a lot of you guys have asked that i react to the season one of young royals on netflix now i'm doing this video to show my love and appreciation for those of you who are showing love and support to my channel and to what we're doing here on demi god ent you know i'm trying to do really big things with this channel i'm trying to grow it to new heights and really get out there we're a brand new channel and we're already over 500 subscribers doing pretty well here um, hopefully very soon here we'll be hitting even a thousand and past that so all that being said I'm excited to get into the young royal show here if this episode one reaction does well I'll be able to bring you guys the other five episodes I believe there's six total episodes inside of season one of young royal so it won't be too hard to go over just six episodes we'll be able to crank that out and get this out to you guys especially if you guys are showing support on these videos so I'm excited to see what the hype is about I want to see why you guys are so loving of that video and so supportive and encouraging of me to bring a serious reaction out to it so this is for you guys this is for the true fans of young royals i appreciate all the love and support all that being said let's get into episode one of young royals man let's see what they got for us let's get into the show let's go all right here we go with season one episode one of young royals let's get into this series man let's go oh damn he got fucked up those cuts on him look really realistic it's done very well there he was out partying having a good time i love the way this show is starting off here with obviously something serious happening to him and then flashing back into what that could have possibly been how he got to that point looks like pictures are being taken of him he must be famous right paparazzi baby prince don't take no shit so he's a prince here Right, he has to do no publicity way. stuff the queen because says he's she a wants public figure. We got Bruce Wayne here going yeah. to a uh, boarding school now. Of understanding. Yes. All the makeup they're doing there on him. Oh, they covered up those me. cuts pretty well. This is crazy. We're getting an insight into the mind of the rich, the powerful, the elite, if you will. Seeing the type of stuff they have to do in here. Thanks. Look at this, how choreographed this is here. I feel like we're setting up here for a very good show. Honestly, I like the path that this is going right now. I like this intro so far. This actor right here, our protagonist, he's doing a great job, man. And I, I like what we're seeing so far. For this. Oh, that little pan to the camera, that look to the camera he gave. That was very good, man. Great intro into the show. Let's see where this uh, takes us here. Oh, he's at the Ridge Schools. Look at these shots. Beautiful scenery. Looks great. Great camera work, great cinematography here. They're doing TikTok dances there. <laughs> this is crazy. I mean, he's the prince, and he's going to be at a regular school. Well, not a regular school, obviously a rich school, but still a school nonetheless. With all these other people here, how are they going to treat him? What is his interactions going to be like? If you think about it, it makes sense for him to be going to this school. He's going to meet a lot of peers that are kind of... Really you know, in the same realm as he is, the same riches, the same type of families, you know. And obviously they aren't royalty, but they're damn near close to it. They're elites, right? Look at all this, man. All this photography he has to do, all the pictures he has to take with everyone, all the press and the media he has to do. A lot of pressure on his shoulders, man. His cuts are coming back up there. You see that? Nice touch. He must have got his ass whooped inside that club. <laughs> Look at this, constant pictures in front of all your classmates. This is so crazy. Hey, that boy can sing, man. He got some pipes on him. Okay, he's coming around. He doesn't exactly hate this place now that he's arrived. This is a crazy life to adjust to, man. The life of royalty, the life of a celebrity. Gets his own room at this boarding school. Definitely much smaller than he's used to, right? Everything you do reflects back on our family. The voice it's acting is very so solid with inside of this show. You it lines up damn near perfect here. And I'm pretty sure this was filmed in a different language, so it's pretty amazing what they're able to accomplish. 
It's not right, man. He was just chilling in a mansion. Now he gotta be in this tiny ass little room. <laughs> With us interns. Wouldn't that be fun? You're getting huh? a good opportunity here. You gonna take it? They can't even You're get alcohol in there. That's crazy, fun. man. They got this place sewed up, huh? She seemed uh, a little <laughs> off. She's clearly dealing leash. with something. Yeah. I guess we'll find out what really that is. Off. Very protective over her horse, eh? Makes sense. Um, She's, you know, building a bond like with that animal. Go, go away. Damn. What is she so mean for, bro? What What the hell is going on with her? She's dealing with, like, some family issues or something like that. Like that. That's a beautiful shot right here. Beautiful. I don't care. I get right in between the trees. The trees aligned on each perfect. side. How beautiful and vibrant that green looks. Back. At least no one picks on me. Handheld camera. That was a unique I, shot that they went with there. Now, what's the age group supposed to be in here? Are they supposed to be, you know, on the verge of graduating from high school? Uh, if I had to guess, I would say that. Let me know that down in the comment section down below. <laughs> they memed him? No way. Oh, shit. Oh, he headbutt some kid. He's a savage, eh? Oh, man. I ain't expect nothing like this to be happening inside of this show. She a fan of the young prince, eh? He goes to her school now. So, I'm sure she'll have some interactions with him. Ew, Maddie. I'm not the one watching porn. I wasn't. Yeah, don't say ill after you were just doing whatever the hell you were doing. Why are you even so obsessed with him? He's you royalty. You're from like the richest family because ever. Because he's royalty. Okay, but if yeah. it's about four, four, three years. Uh, or else you'll be labeled. She's putting her hands all in her hair after what she, what she was just doing, bro. Are you serious? Have some in respect. Way, God damn. Like, Touching all over here. Uh oh, man. I'm not hungry. Yeah, she's going through a depression okay. or something. See you later. For whatever reason. I guess, you know, we'll find out. Oh, but she looks all happy and stuff on Instagram, doesn't she? That's what it'd be about that social media, man. Everyone looks happy and living their best life on there. You see that how she looks in real life? She's depressed. She's down bad. Mommy, can you sit up straight? Let's Whoa. try to have some table manners. Gonna talk to your mama like that? Yeah. She can sit however she wanna sit. The first bunch of losers will never amount to anything. What the hell are you saying? And a lot can of the people inside of this show, you know, they got a real attitude problem, to to don't they? Her and this chance. other girl. So far, the horse girl. The Why? good thing is the high schools mm. inside this show yes, legitimately look their age, which is school? always a nice touch. Yeah, His initiation. Nice. I'm sorry, but the first year's I wonder what they mean by that. It's pretty it's nice. Awesome to just chill. Uh bunch of yes men. <laughs> I was kidding. You are allowed your own opinions, it's cool. Facts. Be yourself. The hell? He is way too far away from his screen to be playing on that well, little ass monitor. You better sit in your damn desk chair. Invited, oh, the they're playing a way out. Fantastic game. Definitely go fun. check it out if you haven't played it. Look at them. They're all obsessed with the prince here. This dude feel like he in prison. <laughs> I guess this would be a prison to someone of his stature. It's not even called welfare. It's oh, called God. deduction. Like your dad. Classism. How much you subsidies does what he the get? Your dad this is nice. We're getting a nice blend of classism in here, and you know, hearing them debate it, both sides of it. Okay. They're trying to groom him. <laughs> they don't want him talking to him every damn day. <laughs> I swear, I used to have that shirt right there uh, back when I was in high school. <laughs> A beautiful sculpture right there. Yeah, got David. You need some for a party. Is booze illegal here? Or I'm not, not quite me. sure, you know, what the emphasis on alcohol is here in this show so far. Maybe it's just a campus thing. It's hard to get on campus. I'm gay, Dad. Oh, right. I'm sorry. <laughs> he doesn't seem very connected to his father. Um, I wonder why that is. Why he doesn't want anyone knowing that, you know, he visited his dad. Oh, what the hell? They kidnapped him? This was a very weird transition. What the hell is going on here? Tying him up to the statue. It's a ridiculous prank, I guess this is. Not even a prank when you're kidnapping and dog walking a kid. God damn. Is this his initiation? Right here? They're doing this to the prince right here? Oh, no. No, no. Bro, come on. Don't do this. Don't make me watch this. Oh, God. Oh my god, they forced him to down the whole thing. Oh man, that is disturbing. That's some frat boy type shit right there. I have some stuff to say there about what we just witnessed there. After we're done with this reaction, I'll go into it a little more in depth. And there he is, he's in with the cool kids, he did it. But hey, you're among your own. 
we could murder someone and nobody would say a word. That's what I'm talking about. He kind of found his his group, you know, people that are similar to him. And he's not joking there about that part about murder. We probably might even see something like that later on in the show. Oh, this kid looks way out of his element. He doesn't belong here. The way they're giving each other the eyes there, they're clearly interested in each other. I assume there's something we haven't found out, you know, about our main character just yet. They could have easily stretched this out into 10 episodes, made his initiation, you know, a majority of one episode. They're kind of going through everything very quickly here, which is, of course, the benefit of having six episodes instead of 10 or 13. She's on drugs. I can instantly tell. She is on drugs. In fact, I think she's on MDMA right now. If I had to take a guess from the way she's acting. Bro, what is up? Oh, man. Do you need help? Oh, man. I don't even want to see all that. Come on. So, I feel like it's almost pretty obvious here that the prince is, you know, a homosexual. He likes men, obviously. With that being said, I feel like that's definitely going to cause some conflict in the show. He's not going to be able to talk about that publicly. He's a public figure, you know. But it is 2021, so who knows? A little yeah, bonding moment chill. here between our <laughs> two characters from completely different lives. Opposites attract. Shh, I don't want to talk to him. Oh yeah, they can't be seen with each other. Down. Classism and all that type of stuff. Why is he trying to get them caught together? What's going on? Yeah, this is getting a bit, uh, a bit strange here. Okay, so there we have it. Season one, episode one of Young Royals on Netflix now. I would say that was a pretty good episode, man. A pretty good pilot or a pretty good setup for the remainder of this show. And we can really see the trajectory as to where this will be going. And considering the hype that you guys have been giving this show, I assume that we're going to be seeing, you know, the stakes upped a lot more as the episodes go on here. And things are going to be happening pretty fast, just as this episode was. Things were happening at a ridiculous pace considering it's only six episodes. So they really have to speed everything up here, you know, fit it all within a, what, six hour time span this is. And so we have a lot to talk about inside this first episode. So of course we get our introduction of the prince here. He happened to get in what looks like a fight at a club. He has to give a public apology, you know, do the press, do the media, do all the stuff that celebrities and royalty and people of his stature have to do. And then he has to, after his public apology, announce that he's going to a boarding school because his parents are forcing him to go to the boarding school. However, due to public appearance, he has to make it look like he's choosing to go there himself to, I don't know, redeem his image or whatever. And so we see he arrives at this school. He immediately gets greeted by the higher ups at this school. What are they? The year three, I believe they said they were. It's pretty much a high school, right? So the young prince is a year one, you know, a freshman. And we're just getting to see how he fits in here, how he's interacting here. He immediately gets in with the higher ups at this school, the people who are kind of running this school, who run the place, the popular kids, if you will, considering he is royalty. It's just who he happens to fit in with. And honestly, him being here at this public school, like I said during my reaction, I think this is perfect for him because he's getting to meet people who are like-minded individuals and who live lives very similar to his. Almost all of them are royalty. Almost all of them come from, you know, families that have some sort of power and he fits right in there and as we can see here as we're going through the motion of everything he gets his initiation into i guess the popular kids gang or whatever you want to call it but what i wanted to say about that that i didn't exactly mention during my reaction i said i was going to save it for after my reaction which is this part right here what i wanted to say about that is it's very similar to an initiation for like a fraternity you know at a college or something like that one of those you know alpha beta delta you guys know what i'm talking about and the thing I wanted to say about that is these are pretty much Freemasonry initiations if you look into those and you know what those are and you you know really do a deep dive into everything that is involved in that type of world you would see that the things that they just put him through is a Freemasonry initiation there where of course he has to be degraded and they were tying him to statues and torturing him damn near i mean he was pretty much being tortured here he was being dog walked forced to drink their spit all this degrading and very low down disgusting stuff that honestly no human being should ever have to go through and quite honestly is pretty common frats and fraternities at colleges and things like that they're pretty much cults is what they are and it all comes from freemasonry if you didn't know that now you know 
However, after his initiation, he seems to be liking his place here at this college, you know, fitting in with the rest of the students, finding his place here. You know, we see them at the party having a great time. He seems to be damn near doing what he was doing before he ended up at the boarding school. All he had to do was go through his initiation before he was able to, you know, experience those benefits of being part of the group, if you want to call it that. And that's pretty much all the character development and all the progress for his character, the princess character that we get with inside this first episode, other than of course his relationship with Simone I believe you say his name Simon I guess it would be we see them have a little connection there at the end I noticed that from the very start you know with the whole choir scene they were looking in each other's eyes catching each other's eyes and by the end of that there we see them having a bond a connection you know and they appear to be attracted to each other so that's going to be definitely a conflict of interest with inside this show. One of the main ones, if I had to guess, considering he is royalty, he is very popular, and especially considering all the girls at this school who are obsessed with the prince, probably not knowing that he swings the other way away from them, so they're not going to be able to get what exactly they want out of it. So we might even see them be jaded there, have some spite, considering that they can't be with the prince, especially that melanated girl who was brushing their horse and Net transitioning from the princess character into her character i didn't exactly pick up on what her name is you're gonna have to let me know down in the comment section down below but i'm curious to know what's going on with her character there obviously she has an attraction to the prince who doesn't he's royalty right but we see here almost with like this attitude problem and issue towards people you know she's kind of like a snob character and she's clearly going through something that the show hasn't exactly told us yet because we see you know her character seems to be depressed actually and i'm curious to see in the show why that is i'm sure they'll convey that to the audience within the next episode or the next few episodes or whatever and yeah man that was a pretty good setup for this show a great episode one i'm curious to know how everything is going to end up by the end of this season and i will definitely continue bringing you guys these episode reactions for the entire season of young royals if you guys would like to see it and if you guys are supporting these videos so all that being said i appreciate all the love and support that was all my thoughts and opinions and my reaction to episode one of young royals let me know your thoughts down in the comment section down below if you don't know what i do here on demi got ent i do trailer reactions show reactions movie reactions movie reviews movie news and unboxing videos so if you're interested in any of that you're in the right place man hit subscribe hit the like button show this video some love i drop multiple videos a day on this channel so that's what you can expect out of me and if you don't already know i am the demi god the chosen one here on demi god ent and i appreciate y'all for watching with me man more videos coming soon stay tuned and i might even have an elite episode one reaction coming up very soon after the release of this video for you elite fans out there i know y'all are still sticking around on my channel i appreciate y'all too appreciate all the love and support like i said your boy demi god is out of this thing man i appreciate y'all for watching with me more videos coming soon stay tuned peace